We're at about the halfway point of the high school basketball season and teams across the city are looking to get in position to make a push for the postseason. The Latin Academy Lady Dragons girls basketball team is certainly no stranger to making a playoff push, having been in the city championship last year and making the state tournament for another consecutive season. On Friday, the Dragons look to improve upon their 8-1 record as they face the South Boston Lady Knights. So let's head out to Latin Academy High School for this one. That's Latin Academy guard Catherine Coppinger, the leading scorer for the Dragons. South Boston playing under man, they only had six players ready to go for this one. That's Coppinger knocking down the three. And then later on in the first quarter, Coppinger inside there to Fiona Mannion, who finds Raven Riggs for the easy bucket. That puts the Dragons up by 11. We're going to go to the second quarter. Dragons still rolling. It's Coppinger wide open underneath the basket, gets the layup for the Lady Dragons. They lead 33 to 11 at the half. Third quarter, Latin Academy up by 20. Ashling Mannion squeezes it home for Latin Academy. They go up 35 to 13. Later on in the third, it's Coppinger. This time with a deep three for the Dragons. She had 22 points to lead all scorers in this one. Late in the third, Casey Zimmer off the drive. She scores the bucket there for South Boston. She led the Lady Knights with 11 points, but Latin Academy was just too much. Fourth quarter, Michaela Russell finds Camilla Munitin for the easy basket. Latin Academy goes on to win 68 to 24. Let's get to some more scores from Friday. On the boys' side, O'Brien takes down Quincy Upper 76 to 43. Kobe Smith, 15 points and nine boards. Brighton takes down Latin Academy 81-61. Jordan Galloway with 17 points in a school record 20 assists for the Brighton Bengals. Charlestown took down South Boston 72-56. Lionel James 26 points and 10 rebounds for the Charlestown Townies. And then New Mission took down Madison Park easily 71-43. New Mission the number one team in the Boston North standings right now. Boston Latin loses to Waltham 46 to 39. Nicholas had 10 points and 10 boards for Waltham High. Girls scores for you from the weekend. West Roxbury takes down Boston English 50 to 29. Bradham 42 points for the West Sea girls basketball team. Meanwhile, Brighton takes down Charlestown on the girls side 63 to 36. Ambers with 23 points and 12 rebounds for Brighton. And Waltham takes down Boston Latin on the girls' side as well, 57 to 46. Several teams with dominating performances on Friday as they look down the road to the playoffs in just about a month. One player who knows she'll be playing competitive basketball well beyond this year is new mission center Dania Davis-Stewart. The 6'3 senior center has committed to play basketball at Merrimack College next season. Stewart has been a four-year starter at New Mission High School and last year averaged 16 points, 11 rebounds, and five and a half block shots per game. She's also made three City League All-Star teams and is well on her way to a fourth this year. So congratulations to Dania. Also making some news on the college hardwood is former Latin Academy point guard Rayshon Miller. After accepting an academic scholarship to attend UMass Amherst in the fall, Rayshon has walked on to the Division I UMass Amherst men's basketball team. Miller was a three-time All-Star in the Boston City League and scored over 1,000 points in his high school career. So congratulations to Rayshon. That's just a great story about that young man. That's going to do it for sports this week, folks. Be sure to come right back here next week for more on Boston Neighborhood Sports.